Joker. Leo thinks this is uh, actually one of the matchups that Joker like he struggled in. Oh really? Yeah. Okay. He actually thinks Mario. He thinks Mario does well in the matchup. Okay. We'll see uh, how these two players match up. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense. I don't think uh, Snake does well against Joker at all, so it makes sense that he's going with this character. We'll see. We have a, quite a bit of Mario's in SoCal too, so I know uh, Nitro's played against Master uh, quite a bit, so he's not going to be a stranger to this character at all. Oh, yeah, 100%. There's a, a decent amount of Mario's here in SoCal that are PR level. Much damage though. Yeah. I'm not gonna kill, but I'm gonna bring out the homeboy Arsene. Is this is where the real match starts. How well are you uh, dealing with this Arsene Joker? Oh, get out of here. Immediately caught the double jump, but honestly, when you get back in that position, it's, it's really rough to get back to uh, the stage. Yeah, it just, it just comes down to if Anti felt if he was gonna pull the trigger or try to bait in there. Uh, it looks like Nitro definitely willing to pull the trigger earlier in that situation. Back airs are hitting way too often. Dude, uh, like the sound that back air makes when it hits, <laughs> you're like, jeez. Yeah, it's very demoralizing. Nice, get the extension with the grappling hook as well. Even without our sin, I feel like Nitro's been playing this stock really well. And it barely not oh, there able it is. to take it with the up smash, but the redemption coming in with that down air. Yeah, that was actually really good positioning too because he like caught the down jump, or sorry, the down gun as well. Yeah. A lot of people aren't very good at punishing that when Joker's in disadvantage. It, it's hard, but you have to kind of like read where they're going to drift and stay right out of the range of right underneath it. Yep. But it is a very safe option in disadvantage. That's why I feel like Joker's going to be so consistent because he can just kind of put himself in situations where most characters can't really fight their way out of. But, like, he can because yeah. he has a down there. Exactly. And they just put people in uncomfortable positions when they're trying to juggle him, and it just throws them off. Wow, ooh, for the crazy Tetra card in there. Yeah, that was like a super hard read, like, you're going to up the early. It would have killed. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like Anti going to wait out this R10. Pretty much all of it. Yeah, there it goes. It, I mean, he's at kill percent, but he, he might be able to get to, like, 180-ish now. Yet again. Yeah, he's trying to call it out with the back here, just position himself right outside the range of that. Mario has a decent arrow to deal with that too. Oh, yeah. the double. Double? The triple? The anti-special? Yeah. Remember that one match when everything was the anti-special? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was so funny. The Smash Factor, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I remember we watched it. We were watching it in the car on like we were, we went to some SD tournament. And yeah. We were watching it on the car ride on the Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, Nitro's kind of taking that stock there. Let's see what he can do to rack up some It's going to be a while before uh, Arsene comes back out, especially since he isn't really using Rebel's Guard that much. Yeah, but right now, just taking a bunch of uh, tick damage, honestly, from all of Joker's specials. Yeah. Just chipping away at him. He, he's doing the tweak strat right now. Yeah, he, he can get so much damage off of it. It's so good. And there's so much options with like wave land, be reversing, and all that stuff. You can have really tricky landings, but not tricky enough to get past the noggin here for anti. Yeah, panic roll there coming off from Nitro. He was at high percent though, so like a lot of people are gonna roll in that situation from the ledge. Right, right. You you just wanna like get away and reset, right? Yep. Snatch them up. Ooh, we'll DI in, so he's gonna take that up there. The worst is when people DI in on Joker down throw with Arsene. Yeah, oh my god. And, and then, then they get crossed up by the up air too. Like, right. Or they just get free back air if they're by the edge. Yeah, it's, it's not good. Nair, hold up though. I like the Nair instead of the up B. It actually made it so like you could follow up harder on the next situation. Exactly. Really good stuff from that type. Yeah. Gotta watch it though. Yeah, Arsene is out. He's doing a really good job. Oh, he gets a combo. This could. Nice. This is gonna drain out all of Arsene. Pretty much, he's gonna go to ledge here, and Arsene's gonna be gone. So yeah, Anti played that whole Arsene very, very well here. Oh, but up smash. Anti air up smash. Wow. Try to fall on top of him with an aerial. Five Mario didn't do that. Yeah. And then just got called out, honestly. 
Yeah, he was doing such a good job bringing that back, too. Yeah, he was. Like, like I said, he played that last Arsene incredibly well. He didn't really... He had these soft resets where it's like, oh, if I get this soft reset, I'm going to drain even more Arsene meter, right? So it's like, that that was really well played by him, but just caught him slipping with the hard air drift in there. And just a really great call out from Nitro with the up smash. Oh, Snake's out. Oh, okay, Snake. Snake versus Joker now. I feel like a lot of people, at least like right when Joker came out, everyone was like, oh, yo, Joker beats Snake. But I, I don't still, know. I still think Joker beats Snake. Okay, okay. I, I don't yeah. know what the consensus is now, because obviously, like, the Joker meta has, like, very much so developed. Yeah. Like, if anything, if he beat him, like, when he first came out, he beats him even more now with how much better Joker has become. But uh, I honestly think the projectiles are like, like like there. The gun being able to destroy the grenades really easily is really good. If he wants to, he can Grab rack a grenade up. And rebel guard. Yeah, yeah, he can rack up meter really easily. Jello snake really well. He can kill him relatively early in comparison to other characters. Also, edge guards him really well. But can you get in? Yeah, that's the yeah, question. Okay, but that's what that's what separates really good snake players when it comes to this matchup. Like, how good are they? Just like keeping Joker out. And racking up all his three percent without being put in disadvantage. But nice drag down. Ooh, Ooh, again, again. Oh, cross up. Dead. Yeah. With the cross up, my he man, died Nitro. A hundred, which Damn. is early for Snake. Dude, that whole sequence yeah, that was, was that was clean. That was very Joker main esque. <laughs> that was a very top tier privilege. <laughs> I mean, amazing play by Nitro. I'm not trying to take anything away from him, but. Man, that was a uh, great usage of Arsene. what makes Joker so strong, right? That Arsene. And he had to get the cross-up at the end, too, which is what I really like. Um, he set up everything perfectly and then got the cross-up, too. Using up gun maybe to try and shoot away the... Uh, yeah, definitely. Ooh, man, you can't shoot that boot away. Yeah, he uh, kind of got greedy there, trying to deal with pretty greedy uh, jump in, start a combo, get immediately up tilted for his troubles. And down gun even blowing up those grenades. Okay, so I'm gonna get everything so, started here. Ooh, so Anton's been DIing in every time here. And, uh, maybe because he just doesn't want to end up off stage? Question mark. Like that's that's like the only yeah. thing I can really if think of. I guess if you're Snake, you're thinking like, all right, I'm gonna take a ton of percent Jeez. anyway. I'd rather just like take the percent, not get put in the edge guard position. The fact that he can even down gun and if there's like grenades by Snake, it just pops those grenades too. Yeah. Like we saw that happen earlier. That seems so strong. Yeah. It's. It's one of the things that makes Joker so strong in the matchup, for sure. Right there, I like Anti kind of using that platform as more of like a ceiling. So so the down guns don't, doesn't shoot through the ceiling, so. Yeah. Can, I mean, can Nitro finish off the stock? Oh, the, okay, I guess the so. rogue dash attack with Arsene going to kill at the ledge. Even Snake's going to die to that. that. That move is uh, incredibly good. Especially with Arsene, too. And you like low profile. With Arsene, it's like pretty much a kill move. Starting everything off with down gun. Try to snatch him up with the uh, up B there on the platform. Yeah, platform kind of messed that all up. But still, he's getting a lot of percent here. Even without Arsene. Nice Z drop on the grenade that's going to throw him off set the edge guard. Oh, that was a free backer, but still based off the landing. Getting and he went all for this it. Extended punishes. Oh, he tried to pick it up. Yeah, he wanted to pick it up and like maybe go for a down beat. Still, man, Anti's getting just caught slipping so much, man. If uh, he keeps landing like that, all all Nitro tries to do is just like bait out the landing and like, um, F smash. And right now, this down gun. Look, yeah, what? He, he just doesn't have answers for it right now. And even with all these trades, while wow, he uses the side B, gets behind. Wait, who's gonna get stage control? Wow, Nitro slips past. Oh, this is so rough. Being at the ledge versus the Arson Joker when his back's facing you. Oh, yeah, that's... You got to play the not... Don't get back your game, but you also can't get hit by a lot of other moves. And there goes Anti losing 0-2 to 